So what's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. This is Amber J. So look, I have a very important word that I'm going to give to you guys today, okay? You take it how you see fit, all right? But look, um, the word is this. Whatever God told you to do, no matter how foolish, silly it sounds, you do it anyway. You do it anyway. Look, there's a blessing for obedience, okay? Look, God, God desires obedience, not sacrifice. For whoever this word is for, God told you to, to do something so specific, and it almost seemed a little bit minute. It almost seemed like, well, what this got to do with anything? Like, this is so random, God. And then on top of that, it's not anything really specific. For some of you, it could be specific. For some of you, it's not. It's kind of like uh, an Abrahamic uh, instruction. Like, you know how God told Abraham, um, get up, leave your uh, family, and go to a place I'm going to show you? That's not specific. You know, specific would be like, you know, get up, go three miles up the street. You're going to go to the grocery store. You're going to run into this person named Steve. Steve is going to give you $50. Whatever. I don't know. That's more specific. But for some of you, it's going to be very kind of like an Abrahamic instruction. And you're just kind of like, what? Like, why, God? You know, you don't know exactly how to make of it. But let me tell you something. You follow those instructions any way. God desires your obedience not just your sacrifice, okay? Look, there's blessings for obedience. Okay? Um, and I know for some of you, the enemy might even try to talk you out of it. Be like, God wouldn't tell you anything like that. Or, you know, or ooh, ooh, ooh. let me tell you something. Me personally, I would rather just do it. Believing that there was a word of God. God knows your heart. The Holy Spirit is not ignorant to what's going on in the inside of you. I would rather be obedient, thinking that it was the voice of God, you know, telling me to do that. And I'm honoring to what I thought it to be the voice of God. And you know that it wouldn't be something outlandish like go break up or a happy home or go rob a bank. God ain't gonna go against his word to tell you something. No, it's not that. God wouldn't tell you to break up any home. Let me just say that. Let me just throw that in there. And God wouldn't tell you to break up any home, okay? I don't even know why I'm saying that. But anyway, look, for whoever this is for, God has given you specific instructions on what to do. By all means, do it, okay? This is how important this word is. I literally have a swollen jaw. Like, it's not that bad anymore, but it's still swollen right here. And look, I would never do anything like this. Like, I am literally, it's like 1 o'clock Monday morning, September 19th. Um, I just walked my dog, fed my dog, um, fed my bird. Um, so I'm already really tired. I'm going, I'm going to be obedient to this. Okay. So, you know, you guys look, God has given you a specific word. Follow it. Please follow it. I do believe it's something yoke breaking in that obedience but anyway whoever this word is for look you guys i pray and i ask in the mighty name of jesus that he equip you with all of the strength that you need to carry out the very thing that he has commanded you to do look you are more than a, a conqueror excuse me you are more than a conqueror have strength in yourself okay have faith in yourself i love you guys be blessed good night bye-bye